Okay, do you think is intentional why all the YouTubers or other content creators are returning their Apple Vision Pro? To be honest, I'm not surprised myself because, okay, Apple actually give you 14 days or 15 days for you to use their product. If you are happy or not happy about it, you can return it. That's their policy. And because it's something new and they all know, even including myself, I know like, okay, if I can get my hand on it, uh, make video about it, create content about it, as much as I'm the one posting it or I do silly stuff with it, uh, I'll be in a place is that people can see me wearing it, kind of detach myself from everyone or kind of single out myself from the crowd and looking like, uh, you know, I'm, I'm from planet Mars. Then I know there's a lot of attention because the new currency is attention. Attention is the new currency. So for doing that, of course, you're going to have a lot of uh, buzz about it. You're going to have a lot of view and the click. That's the money. So a lot of them jump into it, get an Apple Vision Pro, make a content. And then now it's like, oh, yeah, I don't know what to do with it. Uh, I don't know what is good about it. Oh, it's heavy. Is this, is that. Listen, since the thing was launched or uh, kind of pre-launch and we see how it is. There's, you know, Apple did not release everything about it, but we can really see how it look like how it's gonna be like you can see they put the detail on their website so you know already how it's gonna be like but the experience which is different so people bought it to experience it then realize okay uh no i'm not spending three thousand five hundred on this product that is gonna be useless uh it may be useless now right while we are talking but it will be relevant in the future. Okay, yes, it's not ready yet. Uh, there's not a lot, you know, apps. or You cannot do a lot of stuff with it. And especially, it's like you're wearing it. It's a gaggle. You're wearing it. So it's kind of, uh, I start, you know, you're going to be tired. You're going to be, uh, you, you cannot wear it as, like, it's too long on your eyes. But everything, as a human, we kind of, forget like we adapt pretty quickly to everything but we are the same person that when something is new we will be like oh i don't know like even include myself yeah back in the days when i was using uh like what was it blackberry right uh oh yeah i used to love blackberry yeah if you, you were in the uk in you know in 2000 uh in the 2000 going to 2000 uh, 10 2012 going on up there like you who who are you not to use blackberry it was the trend and back then i got blackberry and my brother used to say and then when they kind of launch the launch the new uh you know touch screen i was like nah i'm not going to use that nah, who want to be touching screen to do what listen right now where i am if you give me something with a mechanical uh, keyboard i i won't be happy to use it I'll prefer to use a touch screen. So anything that is new, we, we kind of don't know what to do with it. And we are like, uh, I think we are all OCD. Nobody like, uh, we, we got autism. Nobody like changes, you know, uh, nobody like changes. And then, but with time, we get used to it and then we adapt to it. So I wasn't surprised that people are returning it. So a lot of people get it for like, what? Oh, let me, uh, make content about it let me try let's see what is about and then return it so it's like that so uh i wasn't surprised to be honest and me to be honest will it be a good content to get a create a content send it back yes to be honest but at the same time i don't see any use of it yet like it's not like i don't have the money to go and get it and to be honest i don't have the money so I won't be able to buy it. So people who buy it and then they will create content about it, of course, they're going to make their money back. So uh, we just going to see how with time everything going to develop, how people create more uh, application for it, how it's going to be useful to uh, do stuff. But it's just like wearing it around and all those things is going to listen. It can become the norm when a lot of people are wearing it. It's nothing new. It's going to be, it can become the norm. So it will be like, 
alienated when you have the goggle on in in, in the public and all those things so it, and also there's going to be a lot of improvement about it so uh apple actually get a lot um what do you call it trend and it's like uh, advertising at a high level so they advertising the product in the way to be well known in the market kind of get a buzz to themselves and all those things so it's is a they did a strategy it's not just like they created and then but i cannot say it's something new and also all the engineer that create all those things put hours content like put hours and hours to bring something like that into reality is actually mind blowing so uh technology is technology and at least we know that is something is possible there you know that's the whole thing so we will see how uh the trend will go and how they will improve in the in the near future and then from there we can kind of make our we come back here and talk about it again like oh five years ago ten years ago this was it and now where it is at the moment so it's the same like um uh what do you call it chat gpt or ai people like before you know to, for them it's like you ask something the image was like really bad now it's like improving every single day so it's like that so anything that will come to the surface or is a tech there's improvement gonna happen to it and even if it's forgotten for some time somebody from middle of nowhere will bring that back with like maybe improved version of that product so uh, i think it's like is gonna improve and that's the possibility because you know even google glass is like somebody brought it like almost 10 years ago and everybody's like oh whatever, whatever but it's just the continuation of the technology it will come in just a different form maybe more improved that's gonna be bad of course the technology is there people are gonna uh, always push to the to the to the to the li you know push to the limit and create something extraordinary or something and just improve on what we already have and then move forward so i wasn't really surprised that a lot of people are returning because they don't know what to do with it but a lot of people it's just for the uh for the trend for the uh for for content and all those things to get some view and click and all those things so yeah but the real question is like how useful is gonna get once it's improved that's where we will be looking toward to so if i have a three three thousand five hundred will i go and buy to be honest no because wearing it like you know i'm okay i'm addicted to my phone already and having that uh, of course you are not going to be wearing it walking around you wear it to diffuse stuff and whatever but you are not it's not going to be that useful to me because it's like okay i have ipad how much do i use my ipad to be honest how i visualize that oh, i'm gonna use it and i don't i don't use it that much like i thought i would use it so but it's still there will i buy a new ipad mm, yes no i don't know but i'm not like oh yeah let me get ipad i, I don't see myself buying a new one i have old one it's fine i don't use it that much i use it for few stuff especially when i'm traveling and all those things so that that's it so you see how it's gonna be with the future and then yeah we take it from there so uh yeah that's the video and that's my take on why people are returning there vision uh, apple uh, pro, uh, vision pro so yeah 